Time to get this day going, guys. Do some body weight squats to warm up and then hit a hit some work on the SSB is what I'm thinking. Let's get my little little baby kettlebell out and warm it up. Yeah, it's a good old state squat bar. I think it'll be the name of the game today. Thank you, Jamie. I appreciate it, dude. It means a lot, man. We'll keep it rolling. Keep it rolling. Oh, man. Stretch up there, my hips. A little sick today. Oh, bummer. Hopefully, you get to feeling better. Like a one day thing would be great. Well, come on, hang out with us for a little while, see if that doesn't help you get to feel a little better. That might help. Oh, man. Get the quads going the right way. The hamstrings going the right way. Uh. Now the thing about it, we've been playing with the archer a lot, but I haven't been going for a walk, so my hips are a little tighter, I think. Happens. Hopefully good, good. Yep, we got some work to do in the gym, and then I'll be playing some games after. That's the plan. Yeah, it's fun making a little vlog, huh? It's nice. Kind of found the, the found the occasion, the energy was right. Archer was kind of playing but doing his thing and said, alright, we ought to. Pop on real quick and vlog it up. I like to make those more regular too. Be fun. Yeah, today. Today we get the gym going. And then uh game it up tonight. Which I imagine will be probably at least starting off with WoW. Then we'll kinda go from there, huh? Probably get my hips going the right way. Ugh. I'm glad you like it, man. Like I said, I'd like to do I'd like to do those more often. And my left hip is pretty tight up in there. No, I don't think that'd be. I don't think that'd be a problem, Cammy. I don't think so. Ugh. I don't think any drafting will be occurring. I hope not. Oh man. Be weird. Ugh. Yeah, I really been keeping up. All that. I think the market doesn't like it, but other than that, what? What's, I'm not sure what's going on. Other than the market not liking it. Get the knees warmed up here. So I guess I'll do dumbbells? Yeah, just squats of dumbbells, I guess, right? Lunges, sure. That sounds good to me, too. Yeah. Like, why? <laughs> What's the point? Take it over, or like, what's the deal? 
It's not like I said, I'm out of the loop. I don't know what's going on. I don't own this one space, but I just kind of like it. Maybe I would do fronts today. Let's see. I'm gonna see how fronts feel, because my, my hip is kind of tight, and I don't know if I want to do this this way. I might do it the other way. I'm not committed. One way or the other. Oh. Fronts are sometimes kind of nice. You can open up a little bit more. This might be a little high for the front squat. The starting position. I think we're gonna do fronts today. Fronts feels better. We need to work on deadlifts and squats. Always. You and me both, bro. You and me both. You fell back uh, with a squat or a deadlift. Either way. Yeah, just recover well. Crazy Joe, getting warmed up for some leggies, man. Gonna be doing some front squats today, it feels like. Uh, seems like the name of the game is gonna be the fronts. Do some of these guys for hamstring and glute activation. Do some quads in between, some isolation as well. But we'll have the, uh, the fronts be kind of the main mover today, I think, would be good.
Front's go better when my, uh, that's what I'll tell you. What's the kettlebell working? Yeah, like hammies and glutes a little bit. How do you get the motivation to work out? I, I don't know if it's really a motivation thing. But I mean, I have goals and I, I love the work too. That's the main thing. I do feel motivated to train, but a lot of it's just because I, I love what I do. So I am motivated. And things like goals, good music, good pre workout can help too, but like, a lot of it is, is you love the work, right? You learn to love the process. And that helps. What does not help is this combination of cold air while I'm trying to warm up. That doesn't help. Yeah, you gotta learn to love the process, man. You gotta commit, have some discipline. But yeah, I mean, motivation, a lot of times, you know, can just be like goal oriented, right? Like, what are you working for? What, what has to mean something to you, right? But you gotta also have that kind of thing that's gonna make you get the work done even if you're not necessarily feeling like it. If motivation is just, is feeling like it, sometimes you have to push through the discipline, but what makes me feel like it is knowing that I enjoy the actual work and I also enjoy the, how I feel afterwards, not only during. That helps, helps me stay on the plan. But I do have goals where every day is a chance to improve with those goals. Even if the goals are just feeling good and being effective, right? Not necessarily all just bodybuilding goals or strength goals, right? If one of my goals is to be an effective content creator and knowing that working out gives me much better energy to put on a good screen, like that helps, right? So it's all part of it. And knowing that working out today is gonna make me have a better day tomorrow, another reason to get in the gym today, right? So there's a lot of different goals that I have, a lot of different ways that working out fits into the BBN. The best version of myself that I can be. But a lot of it, like I said, just comes down to loving the work. So, yep. That's part of the deal. The abs. Oh. So. We get the commands going. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds good. Woo. Got to summon our power here a little bit. Get a little bit dialed into this squat set. Try to get legs warmed up. Get one up in general here. Oh. coming up. But we'll try to stay, you know, appropriately short-sighted for the moment. One thing at a time. That's one of the fun things of the gym is it's time where it's okay to just be here right now and doing the one thing and then going from there a lot of the time. That's what I'm gonna try to do. But be here and do this thing. And leg day does have a way of demanding your attention sometimes. So I'm going to embrace that. I'm just also just trying to get my lower body loosened up a little bit. Trying to catch up on rest a little bit over the weekend, so. 
but we can activate that and establish some momentum here during the week. Uh. And we still put another timer. Uh, sure, if you want to. Sure. I mean, if you want to be in charge of, up, like, if you want to make the new vid command do uh, be on a timer as well, that'd be fine. If you want to be in charge of that, that that's great. Promoting the content, sure. Uh, the, the vlog is also the new vid at the moment, but yeah, just in general. If you want to do that kind of thing. Pump the content gains. Oh, way to have a lot of timers though. <laughs> Yeah, I have not been updating that one regularly. <laughs> Whew. But it's there. But not one that got updated a bunch. Got them hips. Ugh. One of them leg days, boys. To focus up. Yeah, try to rest up over the weekend. Don't necessarily feel 
like super energized yet, but I'm hoping it is just in the tank. And we'll have access to it at some point. Let's see. Uh, let's look at it. Yeah, that's fine, man. That's fine. Good stuff. What was on the games menu for you? Uh, gotta pull it together. back. Noise, noise. Hmm. We've been doing kind of pumper workouts like that over the weekend. Uh, probably wake up now. Full swing, but we do not go to feel it. Ugh. It's just a gym shark shorts, Cynthia. We're trying to make some leg gains. It's just them, them shorties. <laughs> What is that, Leo? Working on D-Day, working on it. A little EAA is going here with a Legion Pulse, of course. Your rep range doesn't really matter that much if you're trying to lose weight. I mean, potentially higher reps could burn more calories. On a, on a very small scale, but I would say train according to your athletic goals and then diet according to your aesthetic goals. So just mail your diet and train how you want. Any future shows? Yeah, we'll uh, be competing again at some point, at least I want to, but during a pandemic, kind of, you know, it's not like the main priority to get out and compete, right? The main priority is to stay healthy, stay safe. You can drop that in the gains tab, maybe, Leo. I want to call Legion now? Yeah, I mean, I, Legion doesn't make uh, amino acids because the science isn't strong on them, but everything else, yep. Oh, yeah. 
But I don't think your rep range is that important for fat loss. Buy the dip. <laughs> we might, we might. Most shows you see in Florida. Well, I mean, like, I'm not doing, like, massive shows most of the time. Like, the, the national show that I would do is in Vegas, but yeah. There's no reason to put me or my family at risk, right? Yeah. Legion's fantastic, man. They get my full recommendation. Love to have on the sponsor. Pumped about the fact that uh, we got such an awesome brand supporting us. It's really cool. Show up some love. What's my walk routine? But like that, you're looking at it. This is it. <laughs> you're in the right place. What I'm doing is what I do for leg day. We're warming up. Looking at it. Usually just some light working, you know, light sets on the way up, basically. But yeah, this is it. Third knees, what does that mean? I think you talk about like the like these guys. That's how you talk about. The sweep. And we'll see. We'll see about it. 
We'll see about it. Working on them. Especially that good old full range of motion. And then doing the quad thing in between, yeah. I really don't think you guys can see it. But uh, there's, there's not enough pump and then not enough low enough body fat. But I got a nice little quad vein coming through over there. So later on when I get lean enough, that'll look cool. Won't be, won't be seeing that anytime soon. <laughs> Especially as we're going up with the body weight. But it is cool. See that, that kind of stuff to look forward to later on. recently. I would just say don't spend a lot of money on Monster. <sighs> he is growing fast. I'm enjoying it though. He's such a fun little guy. Such a cool dude. But yeah, I, like I was saying, I think it's probably a good time to get those vlogs going. Is creatine something to look into? Yeah, creatine's great. Creatine is one of those five grams a day, good to go kind of things. And maybe turkesterone is kind of like that, where it's like, doesn't have a, like a massive effect, but if you take over a long period of time, then it could add up and be helpful, you know? Yeah, creatine's great. Uh, creatine absolutely should be part of your uh, supplement regime if you're into any kind of like activity, <laughs> like athletics or otherwise, right? Creatine is just good stuff. So yeah, recommend that for sure. I heard creatine causes a lot of water weight. Nope. That'd be a misconception right there. All right, now when you have your first father-son workout, you must be new here. <laughs> creatine basically provides you with enough of a resource that is used in muscular, like energy production, basically. Yep. It may cause a little bit of more water to be held in your muscle. That's because water is one of those ingredients of the chemical process that creatine helps with. Doesn't make you hold a lot of water though. Not really. Uh. Yeah, Cynthia, so recommend you get the Legion Recharge now. There's, there's no evidence to suggest that creatine has anything to do with your hair. 
That's one. That's another one of those like bro myths. There's not really a ton of conflicting info. There's a ton of. There's literally no info <laughs> about it being that way. <laughs> yeah. Recharge is the Legion supplement with creatine in it. Ugh. There's like one study. The only thing that I've heard of is there's one study on some middle aged hockey team that <laughs> it's like those guys were. Probably gonna lose their hair like most, like a lot of middle-aged guys do anyway. So has nothing to do with creatine. <laughs> but yeah, so there's actually not evidence to suggest that. But who knows? Maybe more evidence will be coming out. But yeah, they don't really need to worry about that. It's something people say, but it's not really accurate according to the research that has been done. But if you're worried about it, then don't take it, I guess. ATP is, it's, it, right, ATP has to do with the energy production in your muscles, right? That's what creatine does. There's no relation between ATP and, and your hair. The, the relation that there would be is uh, types of, like, like precursors or something like testosterone or something, but that's, I, I could look it up for you but I haven't put a lot of thought into it because there's not research that suggests it's a link, right? So, don't need to worry about it. Yeah. Yeah, creatine's not like a massive acute effect, but over time it could be helpful, right? That's kind of how it works. There you go, Slendia. There you go. It helps a lot if you're beginning. Working out is gonna help a lot if you're beginning. Yeah. You're probably gonna notice pretty big gains if you're a beginner anyway. Yeah, exactly. That extra rep over a long period of time could, you know, add up to some pretty considerable gains over a long period of time. But yeah, you can think of it that way. Just making sure you have just that, you know, just plenty of energy in your muscles, yeah. Right, the DHT, yeah. Right. So there, people talk about some sort of relationship between DHT and uh, creatine, but once again, it's like, that link hasn't really been supported by research, but. If, if you're not worried, I mean, if, if you're worried about it, don't use creatine. So, simple as that. Oh, it did change both. Did I not? I did. Why is it so uneven? I don't feel even. Okay, Same time every day, but 
other than that, it's pretty simple stuff. Oh man. Boy, oh boy. Gotta throw some more weight on there too. Hips are tight though, man. It's funny, I've been seeing more about vampire survivors now. The game's kind of popping off a little bit. It's funny. <laughs> like a swole thing. Working on it. Yeah, we might. We'll see. We might hit 220 this bolt. I don't, I don't know if we necessarily need to. I think 220 for me is a little higher body fat than I really need, but we'll see. Yeah, it's pretty fun, huh? Pretty fun. Let's see if we play a game all the time. Could be more of that, but maybe start with a while. Could be, a, could be a fun monster on night, we'll see. Like I said, we gotta kinda of focus up on this workout. And go from there. circuits kind of kind of wait oh just got the whole gym to myself so <laughs> well you know what to do Mike good D-Day glad you're here too man yeah having the home gym is wonderful especially during times like this yep it's pretty awesome in general but yeah There you go, Mike. This is my first one, is Rise. I've loved it, man, it's so fun. Sounds like it's a little arcadey compared to the other games, but I like it a lot. Might play more tonight, we'll see. But Wow's been fun too. Main thing is we gotta focus up and try to wake up for the activate here.
start there. Woo. We'll start there. What body prep set I was probably I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Uh might we work out together? Well, I'm working out right now. Get to it. Six or seven, yeah, maybe around seven. I, I have no idea though. I'm taking it slow. Haven't played it in a couple days, that's for sure. But it's all good. We're playing WoW and doing our thing. No gaming over the weekend anyway. This time around. All good. I, I don't know who that is, Swag. Max on box? I don't know. I don't know. I've never done box squats. No. Uh, never really done box squats. I'm not sure what my max would be on there. Gosh, yeah, I'm not familiar, so I might check them out. Yep. Got a war time? Sure. I ain't letting you outwork you? <laughs> Wait, you're not letting me outwork you, okay. Do it. It's a work day, brother. Yeah, God of War, it was fun. We need to play more of it, but like, I don't know. <laughs> I think it's it's definitely limiting my ability to play if we have to get into full console every time. So we'll see. That was fun to do that though, but we probably could just go ahead and uh, play sometimes. You're a freshman in college? You're on a way to get in the big? Yeah, I just gotta eat, man. For being a freshman in college is a fantastic time to make some serious gains, dude. You got this. You got this. Yeah, it, it just came out uh, on PC, so like, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, we'll see how we work, decide to work God of War in. Gotta eat, young man. Gotta eat. Ugh. College freshmen get as big as me in a year if you just decide to eat. <laughs> Won't take you that long. Just gotta eat. 
It'll be fine. Great time to make cakes. My physique is nothing special, I assure you of that. Small defensive end football, yeah. I don't, who, who told you that you were small? <laughs> if you're a defensive end in football, you're way bigger than me. I'll tell you that. <laughs> you're way bigger than me already. If you're a defensive end in football, playing college football, you're bigger than me already. <laughs> Once again, like, somebody could train for, you know, a year or two and be in better shape than me. That's good. Um, I would imagine your college football regimen has you going to the gym anyway, right? Yeah, definitely in the gym. For sure, man. For sure. Absolutely. Oh! Definitely a consistent part of my uh, daily habits. It'll serve you well during and after football, for sure. Defensive bet, that's a big boy. Big fella. You ain't, you ain't got no cash up to do to me, that's for, that's for sure. <laughs> You're way bigger than me.
I'm not sure. So terrified, okay. Like I said, I look like a little baby compared to you. Um. You, I don't really take supplements for joints now. I'm telling you, Jack, your legs are bigger than mine. If you're a 6'2", 250 pound D-line, your legs are bigger than mine. Yeah, I might just be a little bit leaner, maybe. Maybe. 750? Holy moly. That's a big lift, dude. That is a big lift. There. Your max squat is uh, 650. Yeah. I might even be anywhere close to that at any point. On my best day ever, wouldn't get anywhere close to that, man. Now give yourself some credit here, man. Here we go. Show them calves some love. But you don't you don't want to be real low body fat for being a D-line. You gotta you gotta have some body weight to sling around, right? Gotta sling them around. That's how it works. Front squirts. Front squirts. It's tough stuff. I've heard that, Jack. I've heard that before. Brows, some front squirts. I like that. And the squirts and your shark sharts. Shark shark front squirts. Is this your last one? The barbell and dumbbells. Rows, baby, rows. Rows and shrugs and. Deads. Yep. Do I have a broken pinky toe? I don't think so. I did kind of jam my pinky toe in the door the other day, but I don't think it's broken. Uh, 
front squats and the shark sharks. So far, so good. So far, so good. Has lost. I gotta smack some sense into my brother then. Whew. Really good calf genetics. Yeah, my calves insert pretty low, but I've also been using them for a while too. But thanks for the six months locked in, man. Big flex for you. Thank you so much, dude. I'm not gonna fight you on that though. Definitely have some, some nice low calf insertions. I do. I do. That was called a Vampire Survivors. It's really fun, yeah. You have whack calves because of your Chinese background? I don't think that dooms you to not have calves, man. I don't think so. How do I shave my head? Well, I, don't, I don't have to, but generally like once a week is good. I need to clean it up here pretty soon. Yeah. You do more in front squat than you? I don't, if you squat 650, you're squatting more than 150 on front. Is it possible? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, I mean, it'd make, it'd make 30 minutes of cardio go by pretty quick, huh? Yeah. For sure. Did I fight myself? No. I look good with short hair. I got more luck. I look good with short hair. Oh. Sometimes I'll just buzz it if I don't feel like sh razor shaving, right? I got two more of these and it will go up. I don't know, people make a pretty big deal out of it. Like, I really don't care that much. I think I look good with short hair, so <laughs> I don't know. Buzz. 
does the trick in a pinch. Yeah, but I've been, I feel like I've been grown into my grown into my kind of adult look recently. Looking mighty handsome if I do say so myself. <laughs> Mighty handsome. I can't tell if it's the mini cut or what, but growing into the grown into the full grown adult man look. Like alright now. I'm with it, I'm with it. I'm with it. I think being just a teeny little bit leaner is probably good too. Getting all them, got all them forehead veins coming in. Yeah, yeah. And if I say a little leaner, my cheeks aren't as chubby. You know. Thank you, Draco. My mom says so too. I appreciate that. You and my mom have always said that I'm a handsome, handsome fellow. Appreciate it. I think Jenny likes me okay too. <laughs> oh, but thank you, you guys are far too kind. But anyway, yeah, the uh, buzz, I like it, I like it. The buzz and the beard are a good combo. You know, have you guys heard that eventually green eyes won't even be a thing anymore? It'll just be like blue eyes or brown eyes. You guys heard, you guys heard that? That's just the way human genome works? I wonder. Any tips for calf raises? Your Achilles seems to get aggravated after two sets. What are you doing? How long is the bench out about? Not sure. Can I keep the room and start competing again? I don't know, probably not, but maybe, what if, you know? I think what'll probably happen is I'll shave the beard and keep the stash for the kind of classic physique look, you know? You've seen yellow eyes? My, my eyes turn yellow sometimes. It freaks people out. But my eyes do turn yellow sometimes. But yeah, I was thinking for a classic physique, I keep, I shave the beard and keep the stash. Probably a Horlock, yeah, you probably just choose whatever eye color you want, yeah. 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 You're right, you're right. You're right. All right, let's do this set, and then we'll switch it up and do uh, hammy strings. That'll be good. Our big flex for that full year, man. Big flex for it. yeah, exactly. They get the get the classic physique stash, exactly, yeah, yeah. Woo. My man, thank you so much for the big 19 month prize, full master. My man, Swole Master's rocked the stash before. That's a good look on him. You rocked the stash, the firefighter stash. Yes, sir. <laughs> and real good. But the beard will probably have to come off. Maybe, we'll see. Maybe I can just trim it up. And still, still look like we got some aesthetic going on, you know? <laughs> Ron Swanson Pudge. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Let's see how that feels. Hold up, big dog. Woo! Working through a little bit here. Working through. 
Trying to add a few more calories without getting too bogged down and make some gains. Let's see about it. Mutators. Gonna come here and try maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Did they fix great axe yet? We'll see. We'll see. I think I think a slight break from New World is kind of making sense. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Less fixed GA, more fixed idea what happened. Been a little bit out of the loop. The WoW and Monster Hunter rotation has been pretty fun. Need more God of War though. Maybe tonight could be a God of War night. We'll, I'll see how I'm feeling after this. Tonight might be a good God of War night, even if it's not cosplay. Or we could do cosplay, we'll see how it goes. Once again, I gotta kinda stay where I'm at here for a second. Focus up. Wait, did I not? Did I only do four sets of 185? Did I? Maybe. Whatever. Whatever. Four it is. What the fuck? They buffed Ice Spike? Huh? Am I is that am I reading that right? They buffed Ice Spike? What the hell? Oh, it's bugged. Oh. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> oh. Haven't been able to train for one and a half months now. After six months of training, I feel like all your progress is gone. You might feel like that. Hey, probably not. First of all, no, your, all your progress is gone. Second of all, it comes back quickly. No plus on this year? I don't know. We'll see. I'm not vegan, but I, uh, I'm vegetarian. Haven't forgot my years, feels pretty good. I like it. Yeah, I don't know, I kinda doubt it. But we'll see. Even if there is one, I don't know if we'd, we'd be going. No meat, correct, yeah. No flesh. Okay, all you do is four of these. If I can do five, that's cool too, but four is fine. Today, you love flesh, oh, then enjoy it, man. Go for it. <laughs> Back squats, bench. Woo! 
Oh, I'm gonna work on the animal pens. That sounds fun. Well, thanks so much for the raid, man. Yeah, we're doing our thing, man. Kicking butt. Uh huh. I like corn a lot. Yep. Tempeh and tofu are also great. Tempeh and tofu aren't really vegan meat, but you know what I mean. Kind of like a protein thingy. Yeah, I like corn a lot, and tempeh is really good too. Tofu will do. Tofu will do. Although I did have the uh, the Korean tofu from Factor, that was really good. When I work out, should I just drink water during and after or something else? Well, water's fine. I like to drink a little bit of uh, pre-workout, during my workout, a little bit of EAAs sometimes. We yeah, got Legion Pulse. It's like a little half scooper of that, oh baby. A little half scooper. A little bit of caffeine, a little bit of pump from our sponsor, Legion. It's nice. Exclamation mark Legion in the chat will give you our link and our code that you can use to get 20% off your first order and double rewards points every time after. Nope, nope. Grape is one of their many tasty flavors. I think Blue Rat is like my favorite favorite. How much do I squat? Like twice a week. How much weight do I squat? <laughs> Not much. <laughs> Struggling through 205 for four right now, as a matter of fact. I don't know, you can give it a try, Truffle. Give it a try. I, I, I suspect not, though, to be honest. I suspect Scandinavian countries probably will not have access to Legion products. But maybe. Okay. Let's go set this bad boy up for some hammy strings. And get those pumping a little bit while we're the second half of this workout. Uh -oh. Yeah, if you guys are coming from Ben Rice's stream, you're going to be very disappointed in the, in the poundages that we're moving. <laughs> but I'm glad to have you here. Welcome. Some paltry poundages compared to Big Ben Rice. Oh, but I'm trying to get it moving, get some pumps going here, some activation in the leggies. So we can get what we need out of these sets. Some paltry poundages. to get it going though.
not feeling too bad. Woo! Man, oh man. That's a casual. Ah! Hey! I thought you were pretty big guy you could have You could. You could. That's not that heavy. They are, yep, rubber horse mats. They're great for flooring out here. Yep. I probably just make it look really hard because I'm not very strong. How <laughs> I many is it the calf raises? I'm not sure. Probably 20 <laughs> at least. Compared to strong people, I'm not that strong. I do like to train though. I do enjoy the work. Well, I mean, I'm doing, you know, I'm doing calf raises between every set. You know, warm up sets and working sets, so. Kind of adds up eventually. Well, I mean, you don't need to start off with a whole home gym setup. You could probably get some dumbbells. If you had a quest to fight me on the street, I would abandon. I appreciate that. I too would like to avoid street fights. <laughs> I appreciate that. Q dodge in that one. It's best for both of us, I think. Yeah, a couple more sets would be a good way to. Progressively overload there, Mr. Grief. Deckard Gaines. I like that one too. Deckard Gaines. <laughs> I love the. Uh, you guys know Chip Gaines, the uh, the dude with the like renovation show. Jenny likes their show. I love his name. Chip Gaines. I was joking with Jenny. <laughs> I was joking with Jenny today. Our son Archer Jackson, Chip Gaines, Blighton. Would Smith machine front squats be effective? You think? Sure. Sure. You're not getting the whole like you know, like balance, but I mean you're you're still working your legs, so you're not getting as much stabilization and stuff. So it wouldn't be the same thing pound for pound. But like yeah, I mean like if you're squatting weight, pushing with your legs, I mean like you're still getting something out of it, right? Waist looking good. Uh, on a little on the leaner side, try to add some add some mass to that. But yeah, I mean, I'm not. I uh, when I was younger, a lot of my my initial work for years was just on machines, and I feel like I built a really strong bench on the Smith machine. My bench is way stronger than everything else, or at least it was for a while. So I mean, I'm not against the Smith machine. As long as you understand that the Smith machine is not a one-to-one -one ratio of strength to free weight. So don't try to do it and hurt yourself. But yeah, I mean, like, machines, I think, are fantastic for, for building muscle safely. I mean, I would still love to go to the gym and hit machines. I don't really go to the gym nowadays because of the pandemic and whatnot, but... Um, yeah, I mean, machines are great. I think they're a lot of fun. And I think what you'll see is a lot of bodybuilders will say that they built their foundation with heavy compound movements, but then they just do machines all the time now, <laughs> you know, because they're safer. So there's definitely a big value in doing, you know, compound lifts. Um, but machines are great too. So I think you can use them as a beginner to learn what it feels like to have, you know, to put resistance on your muscles, right? So. Yeah, eventually we could put some machines in here. Yep. Yeah. I'm good, Seth. Thanks, man. Thank you for the offer. I'm good on that one at the moment. <sighs> Maybe let's. We'll see. Would you say Smith machine is lighter pound for pound than free weight? Yeah, 100%. Because you're not, you're not you know, supporting the weight, right? So. You feels me? 
All right. Oh. Got another one. Got to do another one. But yeah, we have to figure out how to expand this place, but that'd be fun eventually. What I'm trying to do is to get my parents to move down here with us, like not like in the house, but like in the neighborhood. And then I can put a bunch of machines in my dad's garage. And we're talking. I have the free weights in here, all the machines in his, in his garage. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The dream. Yes. The dream. Because as he gets older, you know, machines are going to be better for him anyway, right? So. Big fucks that prime. Thank you so much. Freaking love. Almost at a thousand pounds more. Noise. You got this, dude. You got this. All right. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on him. I'm working on him, Lucifer. I'm working on him. He's not fully on board yet, but I'm, I'm working on him. My mom's pretty much down as long as she gets a pool. He's retired yet now. And he's still got he's still got a couple years. I'm working on Guardian's good though, you'll like it. Give it a try. Right, Manic. Exact, because I can do my normal training here, and I can do all the machines elsewhere. Pretty sick. Oh, no, Sushi. Yeah, if you guys are looking for a uh, way to get some healthy, tasty meals, look up Factor. Get some of that. Your devil carries your overlift. <laughs> yeah, I'm not quite there yet. It used to, my bench used to carry my overall lift, but the bench ain't there right now. Awesome, Cassius. Yeah, we had some fun. Must have been on Sunday, huh? Could have even been yes. Yeah, yesterday. 
Could have even have been yesterday. Subs are popping off yesterday. That was my third set, wasn't it? We can do one more. I feel like I'm just kind of slogging through this workout. I don't know why. I don't have the juice today. I don't know why. Yeah, it was yesterday. Yeah, we, the subs were kind of popping off last night. It was wild. Uh, slogging. Ugh. But when we're getting it done, and I, and like, I'm feeling activation on those front squats, so that's good. Slogging a bit, though. But this is, this is good. This will help us. This will help us in the future. I think I need to eat a little more, is what it is. I think I need to eat a little more. It's like, it's like time to bump the calories up, I'm pretty sure. But I also think that the extra sleep over the weekend kind of slows down my momentum, even though I needed to, I needed to get more sleep on Saturday. Sunday is just too late to really do anything. I tried to go to sleep early, just didn't really fall asleep very well. So whatever. Just establish momentum and get after it. Today. So we can do it. Another big week, got some fun screens planned. Ugh. Oh man. Ah. Some more factory stuff, some more Nordic stuff, it'll be good. What's intake right now? I mean, I've been doing like 3,500 to 4K, but it might need to be more like 4K all the time. I don't really do hack squats. I don't really have the apparatus for that. I don't know, Lance. Got to pull it together. I think it needs to be more like 4K consistently. You throw your barbell into a corner and throw it on my my shoulder to hack squat at home. Okay. I don't think so, Frog. No. I'm gonna be smelling salts. Uh, Juji brought him over when he came here to lift. That was pretty funny. But no, not part of my normal routine. All right, let's do one more of these and then see where we're at. Darn, son. I only got more caffeine. Let's see about that. This, get, getting this workout done would be good, though. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, see how, how Juju's doing? I think he's doing pretty okay. Yeah, Tom, Tom's not in the picture, I don't think. I'm not sure how Tom is doing, but I think they had to part ways because Tom was... Doing some not as good stuff, I'm pretty sure, right? So. Okay.
Tubbies. Tubbies. Tough stuff. So far, this thing is saying doesn't rub off on me. <laughs> now, me and Juji have different physiques, for one, and also a different presentation style. Yeah. Yep. All right. Have tip, tips for weight loss? Yeah, exclamation mark fat loss, man. I got you. That's the one. That's the one. That's the main thing that you need to, that you need to check out. That video right there. That's the one. I haven't done that. Got to have a lot of confidence to rock a single. <laughs> well, Juju's style has always been fairly like, do crazy stuff. Not, and that wearing a singlet isn't necessarily crazy on its own, but it certainly adds to the whole presentation, right? <laughs> Seeing some big old ripped dude do backflips and stuff in a singlet, it's like, okay, what the heck is going on here? <laughs> what is going on here? Something to this. Uh, yeah, singlet has never really been a big part of my gym attire, so. Don't end up wearing that for training quite as often these days. That's some Gymshark shorties. You want to wear a singlet? Alone at home. <laughs> Respect. <laughs> well, hey man, if you if you look like Juji, you probably can pull off just about anything. You can take your stretchy pants and put them up above your head, or whatever, put it on your shoulders. <laughs> it's still a jack, you know. Like <laughs> you can you can get away with a lot when you're as jacked as Juji. <laughs> he is a really cool guy. I really enjoy hanging out with him. I I do hope that Tom is doing okay. Sounded like he may have been going through some rough stuff, you know what I mean? Here's the hoping. Tom seemed like a cool guy too. Maybe when, when the pandemic settles down, me and you can find a way to hang out again. That'd be fun. Ideally, got plenty of time, right? Got plenty of time. Ideally. Juju would do well at American Ninja Warrior. I would not. I definitely, definitely not trained in that style. In the American Ninja Warrior style. <laughs> definitely not. I do enjoy it in ways, but it doesn't necessarily translate. Got some juicy damage there, Juicy. Good job, man. Maybe. I am American, and I do play a warrior, but I think I'm severely lacking on the ninja part of that. Uh, and I would argue that, that potentially that is the most important part of American Ninja Warrior. <laughs> I think that kind of weighs, weighs out over the American and Warrior part. Oh, I think you can do a little bit of, a little bit of this stuff. Just keep it interesting. A little bit of shruggies, perhaps. We're doing some kind of push thing tomorrow, so. Uh, I don't think this needs to be a lot. Big squats. I can do some shrugs. I 
Alright, DJ, we'll catch you later, man. I got a few more things I want to do here, but we're on the tail end of it. Most of the work has been done. We'll be here for the games later, too. So I guess the volume just comes from the time under tension. Interesting. Interesting. All kind of different ways to train, you know. Oh. I've seen literature suggesting that going to failure isn't necessarily the best way to uh, build muscle to get stronger in favor of reps in the tank with more sets, but I mean, like, if you like it and it's working, but, like, go for it, man. Like, and if you're doing it, if you're doing it like real time or tension heavy, then you're getting probably a lot of volume, even if it's just one set. You know what I mean? So. Interesting. Go balls to the wall. to do it and if you're like I said if you found one that you like and kick ass man it's awesome get after it you know I feel like if you're putting in like really good effort and getting sufficient volume and progressive overload or you're you know you're gonna make gains you know so hell yeah hell yeah I don't really like that particular phrase, casual, just because I like cats, but yeah. <laughs> I know what you're saying. <laughs> it's 
similarly, there's probably a couple different ways to express that particular uh, idea, yeah. Yeah, more God of War fight could be fun. That's all good, guys, all good. We're fine. Just gotta decide if we wanna do the full cosplay. I'm obsessed with the hex bar, man. I've loved it ever since I got it, man. I'm not doing a, I'm not gonna hammer a bunch of uh, heavy lifts with it today, but I kinda wanna do some shrugs. Just for fun at the end of the day. I love it too, the man I'm with you. I could do it like this. I've been doing some of the uh, shrugs like this though. I've been taking it like this. Oh. Grab one for the house, sure. <laughs> Hammer it out at home. Yeah, you'll love it. Build some big old traps. Uh huh. The rogue one, yeah, it's nice. Any cardio? Not so much. I like going for walks and playing outside with my little baby boy, Archer. But I don't really have like dedicated cardio time these days. It's not a bad idea, it's just something that I make time for right now. I use my time other ways at the moment. But I have a, I have a, you know, a history in endurance sports, so I've done cardio. And my diet's pretty good, yeah. Huh. Maybe a Horlock. It's a pretty big investment. Interesting, Ram. Yeah, I mean, you, you could, you could. If you like, if you like that, that, that train of failure, pushing through failure style, yeah. If you enjoy that, then yeah, it sounds probably pretty fun. Yeah. Mm. Might be nice and just kind of play through the story. 
<laughs> don't have to don't have to do much because the game just kind of creates the story for you. Okay. Let's see. Get yourself some Legion Pulse, Rick. Support ya boy. And it's really good stuff. Yeah. Fruit's good stuff, Beans. Yeah. Big fan of apples, personally. Archer likes the oranges. But yeah, man, that's good. Glad to hear it, man. What's your opinion on weighted dips once I, once I got started? Uh, dips kind of mess with my elbow, so I don't do them. But yeah, they're good. They are good for your triceps and for your chest and shoulders. Uh-huh. They just always mess up my elbow, so I just can't do them. That's how it is. But I could, I could use the tricep and shoulder gains and uh, chest gains, but yeah, it's not really the next time that I do. Do I have a girlfriend? I have a, I have a beautiful, lovely, wonderful, love of my life wife, who used to be my girlfriend. Does that count? Even better than a girlfriend. Did I propose to her? That's not sus. When did I propose to her? Was it in 2014? We got married in 2016. Yeah, if you buy them from exclamation mark Legion. Legion, Mr. Deckard. Here you go. That's not about like what age you propose, right? It's When you're in a, for me, it's like when you're in an okay spot to be able to move that. Was I nervous? No. I was pretty excited. Yeah. Nefano, no, thank you so much for the 76 months. Big flex for you. Appreciate it. Welcome back. You're lifting your gaming chair. <laughs> hey, man, you gotta do what you gotta do. I respect it. I respect the hustle. I'm 32 now, I just turned 32. Very cheap meal, I don't really do cheap meals so much, man. I don't like to eat food that makes me feel bad, but I did have a piece of chocolate cake a couple weeks ago, that was pretty tasty. Do a kickflip! <laughs> I think the meme is do a backflip, but I don't have a skateboard. And I couldn't do a kickflip anyway, so. I think the meme is do a backflip though, right? I've seen that more often than kickflip. Maybe that's just an evolution of the meme though. Yeah, no kickflips or backflips for me. I don't have the skill set for either one. I haven't practiced. Do I still compete? I, I mean, I will, yeah. I haven't been competing during the pandemic, but yeah, I, I mean, I definitely plan to. And the training that we're doing, you know, helps us to be better for the next time I do compete, so yeah. But yeah, it's not competing during the pandemic, right? Still part of the plan, yeah. Still definitely part of my goal set. What I'm looking forward to doing, you know, for a good while to come. It's just, yeah, during the pandemic, not really looking to go compete. Just kind of hunker down and keep making gains, you know. Ideally. And I don't know how many gains I've made since the last competition, but you know, maybe. We still got a little bit of time to work. Yeah. I guess thanks. Life on natural, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Indeed. Thanks, 
boss, so working on it, man. Still got a ways to go, but we're working on it. But yeah, 100% lifetime natural, and I, I plan to stay natural too. There's no reason to, to mess around with any kind of stuff that's gonna, you know, hurt my health over the long haul, you know? I like competing, but I just compete at drug tested natural shows, and then you don't have to worry about, you know, competing against people on drugs as, as much. And I just get to enjoy and work out forever, that's good. That's a good idea. Thanks, hero. Glad to hear it, man. We'll keep them coming for you, dude. Keep pumping. Oh, man. Yeah, it's in his it's in his best interest to continue baiting those those threads, Lance. <laughs> oh, that's good. It's <laughs> <a> good exposure. <laughs> and he's you know he, he likes to keep it pretty lean, so the commentary will continue. That's for sure. Do you train this late now in the game all night? Yeah, that's kind of the schedule on right now, yeah. I haven't really used any workout apps, but probably, there's probably some good ones. But I haven't really gotten into them too much. Yeah. Depends on what you're using it for. But I think Legion has good training plans if you're interested in that on their website. Something to look into. If you're interested. Alright. I just don't know what to do when I go to the gym. Okay. I mean, that could get you started. But so can like, you know, my streams and videos if you're interested in just like some basics. I've made like basic workout video guides on YouTube in the past as well. Those could be a resource to you. About done here for today, but you can always catch the VODs or even the gym videos on the games channel. You know, multifunctional machines, like what, what What would be an example of a multifunctional machine? But I guess in general, I mean, as long as you, if it's something that you're going to use and enjoy, I mean, I'll be fine, right? Do I stick to hex deadlift or conventional? No, I do both. Hex deadlift is just easier to throw in, like, kind of any, any workout day, because like, the demand for recovery isn't quite as severe. Right? <laughs> Sorry, casual. Uh, monohydrate's fine. Either one is fine, but yeah. Scale different type exercises. Oh, sure, yeah. I mean, that, that, that could be fun. As, yeah, as long as you use it, yeah. Like my contact my friend. Thanks, man. I'm from uh, California in the United States. Yeah. A hydrochloride. Creatine hydrochloride. It's just different. It's pretty much the same thing. Uh, I think I usually just use monohydrate. But either one. But alright, let's, uh, let's go ahead and wrap it up here so we can get on the stream around 7. Um, kind of thinking about playing some God of War tonight. Is, is it going to ruin everybody's experience if I don't cosplay? Because I still could, but we're going to run out of paint here pretty soon. So, <laughs> that's part of the deal too. I'm not always in the California, you know. Uh -oh. Might be kind of fun anyway. We, we, did, we did the cosplay for a bit. We'll see, we'll see. If I feel like playing some God of War, maybe we will. We could always start off on WoW or do whatever, but uh, maybe playing through a story game could be kind of fun if I'm a little bit tired today. That way the, the game can kind of carry the experience rather than me. Um, but we'll see. Either way, thanks for watching. Appreciate the love. Love in California. It's fantastic. Uh, we will be seeing you guys for the games in maybe 30 minutes. Keep it rolling. See you then. Peace.